name's Kevin Mortimer and I'm the art coordinator here at Support Plus in Milton Keynes. The art coordinator role entails working with people with restricted abilities or learning disabilities and my job and my colleague's job is to kind of get the most out of the, of the abilities they have got and let them express themselves in an energetic and positive way. Um, so I feel it's about presenting their work, promoting their work, um, getting it out into the public domain and get them represented as part of the community. When we think about art, some people are intimidated because they think of Rembrandt and Turner and Constable and great huge works of art in the National Gallery. Okay, so we all think in boxes. We tend to think in boxes. So I've got a box here and if I can open it, we're going to look inside the box of our mind when we think about doing art and it's this. Okay, and it's a marvellous invention, fantastic invention, a paintbrush, but not everyone can use one. People with limited motor skills, limited vision, this is a hindrance, it's a barrier. So what we're talking about is breaking down the elements of art into the real basics, the real basic elements. So all you need, you need a liquid medium, <coughs> a colour medium, in this instance, and after that, all you need is energy. So, energy is just movement of this colour. That's all it is. And that can be with your hands. It can be gravity itself through tilting. It can be almost anything that can manipulate the paint surface and cause a mark. And this is pure expression from, for, from somebody who can't actually use a brush hasn't got the fine motor skills to manipulate fine instruments, but the, the, the actual effect is still powerful, energetic and positive. Ready? Kick. Kick. Kick it. Yes. Kick. Kick. <laughs> Tapping. You want to get... <laughs> Are you trying to get me again? Well done. That's good tapping. Fantastic, Kim. Well done. Oh, yes. There. <laughs> Is that you smiling now? That row, that's fantastic. Well done. 